I've taken the best advice I can on how long Homo sapiens has been on the planet. Carl Sagan, Richard Dawkins, many others, and many discrepant views in those, reckon it's not more than 250,000 years, quarter of a million years. It's not less either. I think it's roughly accepted. I think, sir, you wouldn't dis disagree. 100,000 is the lowest I've heard. And actually, I was about to say, again, not to sound too Jewish, I'll take 100,000. Um, I only need 100,000. Call it 100. For 100,000 years, Homo sapiens was born, usually, well, not usually, but very often, dying in the process or killing its mother in the process. Life expectancy, probably not much more than 20, 25 years. Dying probably of the teeth uh, after that, very agonizingly, near to the brain as they are, um, or of hunger, or of microorganisms that they didn't know existed, or of uh, events such as volcanic or tsunami uh, or earthquake uh, types that would have been wholly terrifying and mysterious, as well as some turf wars over women, land, property, food, other matters. So you can fill in, imagine it for yourself, what the first a few tens of thousands of years were like. Um, and we like to think, learning a little bit in the process, and certainly having gods all the way, worshipping bears fairly early on, I can sort of see why, um, sometimes worshipping, worshipping other human beings, big mistake, I'm coming back to that if I have time, uh, this and that and the other thing, um, but exponentially perhaps improving, though in some areas of the world very nearly completely dying out, and a, a bitter struggle all along. Call it 100,000 years. According to the Christian faith, heaven watches this with folded arms <clears throat> for 98,000 years and then decides it's time to intervene. And the best way of doing that would be a human sacrifice in primitive Palestine, where the news would take so long to spread that it still hasn't penetrated very large parts of the world. And that would be our redemption of the human species. Now, I submit to you, ladies and gentlemen, that that is what I've just said, which you must believe to believe the Christian revelation, is not possible to believe, as well as not decent to believe. <laughs>